judecător, dar acum este șeful Comisiei Europene pentru Sport, cum a ajuns Ivle Lostec în această poziție, dar și care e cheia succesului său, aflăm chiar de la el. At the base, you are a lawyer. You studied at the University of Rennes. Uh, how did you link to sport? How did you connect it to sport? Was it a passion from your young childhood? Yes, it is a passion. Uh, it has been a passion for uh, forever. I studied law, uh, but immediately I started uh, working for uh, the French Ministry for Sport, which was my uh, my objective. So, in my career, I have always. Uh, been more or less involved in sport. I have never cut the link and now I am in the best posi position I could dream, uh, dealing with sport every day. Uh, this, is, uh, this is fantastic for me. But my uh, legal background is useful. I think you must take distance to this, with this because not everything is about law, but at the same time, a uh, legal background helps, can help understand certain uh, decision-making mechanism and is helpful in sport as in all areas. Looking back uh, throughout your career, uh, what was the hardest challenge that you had to over overcome and you successfully managed to do it? Um, my hardest challenge is to uh, has been to convince uh, uh, years after years that the commission is sport friendly mm -hmm. because unfortunately but this is an old story uh, mm -hmm. 20 years ago 30 years ago it was not the case people look up to you uh, please tell us some three rules of success that you guide your life after one thing is to be yourself and uh, uh, not to take uh, orientations and necessarily uh, depending on uh, career objectives or things like that. Uh, maybe I could do something else, but I'm fully happy in sport because this is, uh, this is what I like. The second thing I would say is that you must be balanced in life and that you must have patience, but you must have other things in, in life working, uh, living for just work or for just one thing is not enough. And in my team, I always say I need balanced people. I'm a very uh, discreet uh, and uh, reserved person. Three things that you most cherish at your life. Football. This is, uh, uh, I'm crazy about football. I must confess it. The second thing is the sea because I am from Bretagne and this is a, a country of the sea. And the second and the third thing is reading. I like reading a lot, all sorts of stuff, novels, per periodics, newspapers, I like reading.